Hi y'all, I'm Dolly Farton. I'm going to teach you how to make fart noises on the keyboard and how to play the F for fart major scale. All you need is a keyboard with lots of sounds on it and there's sure to be a farty one. Whoops, I dropped a rhinestone. All right, so I'm going to teach you how to make the fartiest sound on the keyboard. Now, on most keyboards, the best way to do this is to find a saxophone voice. Now, unfortunately, this is a slightly higher quality keyboard, so this saxophone actually sounds kind of realistic. At least it has that airy sound and some vibrato. I don't know, some farts might have vibrato, but... It's really better when you have a lower quality keyboard to get a farty sound from their sax voice. Now there's a variety of saxophone voices here. And usually you want to hit like a nice low note. Oh, you can't even see my hands. Well, this keyboard actually, I can go down an octave. No, oh, that's not that farty. Very sax. Yeah, so these aren't that farty. I found that the fartiest tones on this keyboard are really going to be synth sounds. Let me find a good synth sound. Oh. That's a little bit farty. Ooh, a low note's farty. Alright, let's learn scale. Hmm. Let me make it a little lower so it will be fartier. Eh, that'll do for now, but you'll have to experiment yourself to find the fartiest sounds on your own keyboard. Now, another good option for farty sounds on a keyboard is to choose some kind of brass tone. Now that one's not, well, it's a little farty if you play it lower, but... Now my keyboard has this cool little thing right here that you can just turn through and cycle through all the different sounds. Trumpet? No. I think I'm going to have better luck with a trombone. Yeah. Oh, it's slightly farty, but again, I think that's going to actually come out better on a lower quality keyboard. You might get a nice farty tone with some of your low brass voices like trombones or tubas jazz trombone and a French horn that's too nice and tuba's good well that's a very rumbly part all right that works as well now we're gonna learn an F major scale because F stands for fart all right so if you want to find your F Find where there's three black keys in a row. Go to just the left of that. And that's your F. I'm going to move my camera back. Alright. So, the fancy thing about the F scale, if you've already learned the C scale, is you do have a black key in this scale. So that's your B flat. But that's really the only funky thing. So if you just start on F, and you'll go F, G, A, B flat, C, D, E, F. And you can go back down, F, E, D, C, B flat, A, G, F. And then you can also play an F major chord. Now the great thing about the F major chord is the first two letters are F and A, which are also the first two letters of fart. So if you want to remember that, F, A, and then you just got a C. But you can also just do the F and the A, and it's just like a nice little farty harmony. Now, there aren't any R or T notes, so you can't spell out all of fart, but the F and A, you know, half of fart's better than no fart at all, right? All right. So, that is how you play a farty scale on the keyboard. Oh, whoops, I dropped a rhinestone. Thanks for tuning in, y'all. See you next time.